There's no way this country can continue on if we have a criminalization clause. And until we realize that, then we, we're going to have some issues. So I'm going to be pushing back against all our elected officials and our politicians to basically have them speaking on amending uh, the 13th Amendment or at least having a, 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 a reaction from them. Because I don't think they really understand that until... Uh, we are freed on the federal level, okay? Just like the government is trying to federalize the elections, they have federalized prisons, okay? So if you're not in a state prison, you're in a federal prison, you literally are a slave. And the 13th Amendment reads, neither slavery nor involuntary servitude unless criminalized. And you know without a shadow of a doubt that the entire black race is the criminals. And this is why they eat so good. And this is why they keep the scam scam going because on a, on a federal level, we still slaves. And until we can have that conversation, we ain't talking about nothing else. And with that being said, hey, straight politics coming at you. And we're going to be in front of this because it's better to be proactive than to be reactive. And like I said, we're not as dumb as you think we are. We let you do what you do by being silenced. But now there's some pushback. So now you guys are going to either have to get out the way or step your game up and understand what we're trying to do on the grassroots levels, not on no federal level, not on the level that you own, not baked into any political party, because clearly the Democratic Party, by definition, means ruled by the devil.